Yeah, I think it was. Uh, there wasn't a ton of defense going on. I didn't think uh, either way, but that's okay. You know, I thought we. Again, you look at the numbers. We shot the ball well. Thirty-one assists. So you know, a lot of guys with some pretty good nights there. So Norm take a W. Of, that's for sure, man. Norm is kind of stringing together those four good games out of five nights that you wanted. Are, are you seeing it any differently with him? Is he doing things differently? So just, yeah, I think the I think the only thing um, we've talked about this already. I think the only thing is is that he's in the open floor. He's being decisive and putting the jets on and going to the rim, and he's finishing. And I think a few games ago he was looking around and trying to figure out what, where to go and who to throw it to and, think, you know, and, and wasn't making the right decision all the time. But he's, what I like is the speed at which he sees the open floor and goes to it, reminiscent of a few years ago. He's always done a, a really good job of getting to the rim, but I remember early in his career he had some trouble finishing. Is that just something with time and, and I guess work that he's put in that that just get better at that? Yeah, I just again I think the decision of of I'm going for it, you know, and and now you're not you're not hesitating at anything or looking out of the corner of your eye. You're just you're just really going. But I think more than anything, it's just the the speed, Josh. He just he just is accelerating by people and getting a little clearer shot maybe rather than on most of them. You had a couple tonight where you had to move it around somebody or go directly over somebody. But most of those, when he gets you know, extra burst, he gets clear and clean and he making them. Does a stretch like this make you reconsider what the starting lineup might look like or what the units might look like once everybody's healthy? Or is this just yep. that that's his role coming off the bench? And no, it certainly, it certainly will make me reconsider it. Pretty good showing uh, this evening. Um, what, what did you what did you see from him in like the, the twenty? Yeah, he, 20 he, minutes? again, he got some fast guards out there, so we we need some speed. He's he's got he, he's always a, a impactful player defensively, um, and and even though he's maybe not the greatest offensive player in the world, he's still a smart offensive player. He'll cut, he'll make the right pass. He's a good passer. Um, not, nice to see him knock down a couple tonight because he re he really really put in a lot of work this summer on a shooting and again with the in and out with the injuries he hasn't had real a chance to get into some rhythm so it's nice to make you know see him knock him down um, he's good you know I just I just like his overall IQ and his athleticism and his defensive prowess is, is he the, the kind of player who, who can who you look upon who can always impact a game even if it isn't necessarily showing up in the box score for sure yeah, I think that's I think that's a good way of putting it. He's gonna he goes out there and plays well. Even even the other night, he, I think it was one for seven, right? That's my that's one of my favorite nights when I say one for seven and he had a great game, and uh, he did. You know, he, he was he's impactful and, and he's experienced now, right? He's he's been around a little bit and he's played. In, he's I think he started in the finals at least once, so he's got three rings. He's on his way to catching Bill Russell. <laughs> you kind of mentioned some things for him, but um, Chris Boucher over Rondé in that, that spot uh, with the bench unit, was that just giving Boucher a shot, like something in the matchup there? Or? Yeah, I just, uh, I just uh, Rondé had a little bit of a, a little bit of a tweak on a, on a hamstring or groin or something was, was a little, you know, he did participate in practice yesterday, but it was kind of iffy going in, and uh, this just enough of a reason to give me a chance to go ahead and let Chris run out there. I'd, I'd really like to play, find a role for Chris. I think he's played with great energy and um, seems to always block a shot and make a three as soon as he steps on the floor or, or when he steps on the floor. So it's, it's again, uh, I'd, again, I'd like to find a, a chance to play him a little bit more if I can. So we'll see how I can figure that out coming up.